Hello everyone, Praise Good here. Welcome back to more of new Pokemon Snap. Last time, we went to the level two, well, we went to the snow fields and immediately unlocked the level two variant of it. And now we're gonna take another pass at the daytime level two variant. I have to say exactly what's going on because some people might get lost. But we're gonna go to the daytime level two variant of the stage in an attempt to get pictures of things that we definitely glossed over. Like the Weavile and the Roaring Mammoth Swine. Now, for as much as I don't want to say it, because you know they are good, they are good Pokemon. You got, you, you must, you must be this. You must be like this. Hit it like this. Oh, that worked. Huh. There was something in those holes and I missed it. It must be more furred. There we go. Uh, where, oh, did, where did it take off? It must be overhead. Wait, are you looking at something up there? Huh. I, I, yeah, I'm still like very much misleading myself. I'm very much misleading myself in my research here because I feel like I, uh, I feel like I'm very much missing, uh, several photos, like, or several quote unquote cute photos. Now, let's see. Now, here's one thing. The council shall meet by this rock. There is the council meeting by this rock. Do you not care? We're gonna keep looking. Oh, a Vivalon. Do you care about these rocks? Or care about these? All right, well, I'm definitely gonna see that another time around, but make sure to turn around, catch one of these mammal swine yelling at something. I think it was you. There, caught that. Even though it was a bad angle, I caught it. We take those pictures. No, literally, we take those pictures. Anyway, we're gonna go take our toboggan ride. Hell yeah, toboggan capabilities! And... Snom. Anyway, leave that there while I focus on the uh, snow rut in the snow here. Well, I've uprooted two of them and hit a third. I don't know what they're going to do. Is that a, what did I do. Yeah, it is a snow runt over there. Let's take a nice, yeah, let's take a nice couple of one star photos of you. Hey, snow rut, would you like this? Oops. Nope, you wouldn't. All right. Well, I'm not going to disturb the frost last again. I'm just going to take a picture of it sleeping and let it sleep this time. It's all about vari variables and it's all about variables and using those variables to your benefit. I think this time I'm going to actually use turbo a little bit to catch up to this Vulpix early. Hopefully that will help. And also a picture of this and a picture of you. Got it. Hello, swine up. Yeah, you smell it. <laughs> Gosh. Why is it so cute? How do they manage to make swine up adorable? Alright. Oh, I meant to do this. Don't disturb it. Rude little children. Vulpix, would you like this before I leave? Nope, you would not. Okay, well that went incredibly fast, actually. <laughs> now that, uh, but now that we've 
taking a second crack at daytime. Let's see. Let's see if we can, if we'll have enough to unlock level three. If not, if not, we'll head back to, uh, we'll head off to the nighttime variant. Okay, I don't know what I thought I was taking a picture of. One star, we vile, uh, no, let's, none of them are really looking at us, are they? I guess that's the only one looking at us. And I don't know what that cup she's doing, but we're gonna submit it anyway. Uh... Yeah, it's not the best, but we'll submit it. Let's see, preening itself. Let's see if we can outdo ourselves. Sleeping Frost Lass. Uh, second one. It is just vibing. And Happy Pig. Who doesn't like a Happy Pig? Nothing says Happy Pig like you want bacon. These are now things in the internet that I cannot take back. You are welcome for this. Uh, use it. Use it to incriminate me to the to the highest level. Yeah, something caused attention. The fact that it, there's a Pokemon jam. There's a log jam. A Pokemon log jam, if it were. Is that really all you're gonna say about every single Pokemon out here? Is hmm, it's on its way somewhere. Okay, well, I definitely didn't get a good picture, but I'm filling in that photo dex, and that's what matters to me. Nice work. And this is also a bad Vivalon picture, but I want I want it in just in case it adds points to our overall score total. Now that you don't see every day, Professor, it's yelling. It's yelling at the moon. Yes, fairly common behavior for a metal bird to be preening itself, but I mean, it's a bird. So did I do any better? Not really. Anyway, the Sleepy Frost Lass is... Good. And I am much closer to the it, much closer to the friend shaped Pokemon. There. That's a little better. We take those. And I managed to get closer to the Vulpix this time, though it was turning. Yeah, it was turning. That's unfortunate. Don't tell me bit better timing, bit better timing my butt. That is a happy pig. You can see how happy that pig is. Shut up. Okay, I don't think we got level three. Correct, we did not get level three. So, now is the time that we finally get to go see. We actually haven't had a place where we need it. We actually haven't had a place that has had a, a specific nighttime variant of the same stage in quite some time. Hey. Like if it's had if it's had specifically a nighttime variant, it's been labeled as the Illumina spot. Hey. So let's go see the Winter Wonderland at night. I'm gonna call it now Aurora Borealis. Localized entirely within this let's play. Yes. May I see it? No. Is that? Oh, that's Mighty Anna. Oh, Mighty Anna. Mighty Anna. Mighty Anna. The great outdoors doesn't pull any punches. Correct. Mighty Anna is kind of a bully. What are you doing? You wow. Man, I remember Mighty Anna, and longtime viewers might remember Mighty Anna as well. Like I had a. Uh, I use the Mighty Ana for a uh, for a dark monotype. Would you stop? Yeah. Leave the snow runt alone. There, that's something up there. That's a bear. T that's a braviary. But ugh, I didn't even get a bad picture of it. Cause I was too slow on the draw. Oh, I thought this was my. Something's gonna cave that in, by the way. But yeah, there was a bear tick up on the cliff. Yeah, I see you. Making a ruckus, making a problem. 
The, the, hi! Hi, adorable friend. But, oh. Oh, yeah, you, yeah, do you see the problem? Run away from the problem. There goes the braviary again. It, okay. Over here. Aha. Did I get a picture of it? I hope I did. There's a lot happening here, so it's really hard to get a picture. I at least got a picture of it. I really wish I could have gotten a uh, closer picture of it. It's really hard to, de to predetermine a Pokemon's flight path. I at least got that. <gasps> That's a lone sand slash. Yeah, I thought I saw something. Like, it's like, I realize ice can freeze in shards like that, but that's... With how f much fresh powder is here, that... That had to be something. Anyway. Now, Snom, become Frostmoth. There is no Snom. Oh, no, it's Santa. <laughs> Never did you think you would have to fear Santa. Uh... Oh, no. Oh, it's the pile of misfits. Wait, where'd you go, Delibird? It's in there. Well. Could you face me, maybe? Okay, you know what? That's good enough. Because we gotta get that picture of Jinx before it gets too much later. Because... <sighs> Gift? Do you accept gifts? Well, I missed a picture of Delibird I'm going to come back for. Hi, Piplup. Is there something you need to show me? Fine, I'll, I'll zoom up here. What's the, what you guys show me? Oh, hey, it's our president. <laughs> Bad joke. I was kidding about Frostmoth. I was kidding about Frostmoth. Expires to a rock. Oh, no. A rock. Uh, you are now on display. Oh, there goes the Delibird again. Well, Obama Snow, I'll see you around, buddy. Oh, no, there... Hey, one last chance at Delibird, eh? Alright, there we go. Two pictures. Yeah, are you... Wait, where did the... Oh, I missed where... Oh, it just ran off this way. Do you care for this, Obama Snow? Oh, you do. Hi. <laughs> Why is looking Obama Snow dead in the face like the most terrifying thing to me? Just Hi Obama Snow. So Okay, well I'll rethink I'll rethink my life decisions. Thank you for reminding me of my mortality rate. Braviary was staring at us from the at the end, wasn't it? Hello. Ah, okay. Just know that when I make that truncated noise like that, that's frustration. That's pure undistilled frustration. Okay, well, I at least got a picture of Santa, so all is decent. Oh God, you're adorable. One Braviary, one terrible. Photo of Braviary coming right up, Professor. And that, and. Huh. The Piplup calling to us is a unique interaction. Still can't submit Crystal Bloom pictures. When will you take. Let, when will you let me submit a picture of Crystal Bloom, Professor? When will you let when will you let me do the research in advance, Professor? I'm trying to We both know 
that this is what you want. Precisely what you want is you want photos of Crystal Bloom. A new discovery. Nice work. It's in a hurry, but it's very far away. Where'd you take this with a Nokia flip phone? Shut up. Perfect timing. And yeah, it's better. Fur it being adorable. Listen. No one is immune to the adorable fur. Nice now this is going to be a bad ranking because I basically got a picture of it very off place and not approaching the player. So is this because it's facing the opposite direction. Nice work. Though I do know that sands that Alolan sand slash can be obtained. I just have to hit it in advance. Perfect timing. There. It's a little bit better overall. So we take those. And here is the Pokemon that everybody likes to dunk on. Though I think if I remember right, Gen 5, this was like a major threat in the meta. And then after Gen 5, it, it went back to being a joke. I don't know. As much as I talk about the meta of the Pokemon of the mainline Pokemon games, I know like none of it. Because I don't, I don't competitively battle like at all. A new I have plenty of friends who like to competitively battle. Me, myself, though, I don't see it. I don't see the appeal. I'm weird in that. I'm well aware. I guess I'm also just not super competitive by, by default. Yeah, I'm not super competitive by default, so I just don't see the appeal of the of the fighting like that it's trying to have a nice meal and then I surprised it and said psych no meal I'm here in your face that's oddly pick that okay I like realize I say that this about a photograph but it's oddly picturesque it's like it's perfectly framed almost Hey, I'm not going to get any better than that for a while. I, lo I love how Fro I was like, and Snob, become Frostmoth. Oh god, you actually did it. Oh wow, we have a lot more to cover before we can even get level 2 here. You know the thing I was trying to do? <sighs> Razzin' Frazzin' Snaffin' Naffin' Flaffer' Flaff' Faff' Feffer Neffer. Anyway, now that I'm making up words, I think we'll call things here for today. Everyone, thank you so much for watching this episode of New Pokemon Snap. Come back next time. We're going to go back to the nighttime variant. Try and get a photo of a Crystal Bloom for the Professor, even though we've been trying to do that for the last four trips through the Durice area. But we'll get him that uh, photo of that Crystal Bloom, as well as handle a few things at the nighttime variant that should get us level two almost instantaneously. I'll see you folks then. Take care.